Hello Pokemon fans! So I recently got this card in and I'm happy about it but also a bit sad because of what might be one of the dumbest mistakes I've ever seen in Pokemon card trading. So I recently got this card in and it's a gorgeous card. It's a light Dogetic from uh, Neo Destiny, a rare set. Uh, just before uh, Expedition, Aquapolis Carriage from uh, Wizard of the Coast. So, a while back. And it's the only set featuring light Pokemon. Now, this Dogetic, it's gorgeous. Just look at that art. Flying in uh, the universe, into space, all of the the holo here, just just a great card. And I bought it as mint for a great price. Um, I think uh, 20 or 30 euros. Um, I wanted to pay that much because it was a mint card. But uh, the mint card isn't really that mint. It arrived and Everything looked minty, even the back. Everything is mint, maybe a little bit of whitening at the bottom, a little bit there, nothing much at all. But then, the reason it's not mint, and it even goes to plate, heavy plate, right away, is of one dumb mistake the seller made which just astounded me I was like who would do that and on the other hand I understand how it happened too so it's hard to see but on the holo trying to focus that you can see a little writing right there which says near mint written in letters so that's the n right there and the m next to it it's hard to see on camera but it's definitely there and if it was graded by psa yeah that would go straight down so that would go from a nine instantly to to uh or, or a ten instantly to to a one two three four five Something like that, and that's just sad, because the card is so perfect overall. Put it in the sleeve, right away. And now, how did that happen? Well, <laughs> it happened because of this. The seller put it in one of those sleeves, added a little sticker on it, and wrote Near Mint Mint. And it was on there like that. And he wrote it inside the sleeve, a little bit puncturing the card and the hollow area, creating a near mint. Now, it's a fair seller. I did get a refund, which was great. And uh, he guaranteed me it would never happen again. It also never did happen before, because it was the first time he made that mistake. But it's such an easy mistake to make. And also a warning to collectors, if you write anything in your sleeves, never ever write it while the card is inside. And I've seen it a lot, like this sleeve here also has like written on it, uh, this sleeve here has, has the price written on it, what it's going for, and that's, that's fine. But if you write it, try to write it on a sticker first, like separately, and then like put it on the, on the sleeve and then only then put the card in. It's just, just sad, really sad to, to see that happen and um, yeah, that this card that was near mint mint is now a played one <laughs> and that's yeah kind of sad still love it though it's it's just such a great card I, I absolutely love it and it's a great set i probably plan to collect the other cards um too in the future and uh if you get the chance to still get this card um, i advise to get a first edition you should do so because this set right now is, is, is skyrocketing. It's uh, one of the, the popular sets out there right now. 
everybody is trying to get their hands on a complete one, a PSA graded, 9, 10, uh, especially the first editions. They're um, this card, I think, uh, PSA um, 9, is, um, first edition is now going 300 to 500 euros, um, which I can't really afford <laughs> with my budget buying. So I'm happy with a normal holographic for a 30 euro price. Uh, so yeah, definitely get that. And um, don't make the same mistake as that seller. <laughs> don't write on your cards. <laughs> That's just, just insane. I was really like, how and why, why would you do this? <laughs> just, just wow. But yeah, so this is the light Togetic. Um, it's not first edition, but it's the near mint, mint right at edition. <laughs> so yeah, uh, thanks for watching. Now I'll have more content up in the near future. Uh, put a like, uh, put a comment, tell me uh, what happened to your cards. Uh, did you um, have um, experiences like this? Um, did you also get a card that was written on um, in a dumb way or, or something happened to it in a dumb way? Uh, tell me. And uh, thanks for watch watching. Subscribe. And I'll see you later.